Hey, what's up, guys? So today we're gonna be showing you how to make a YouTube background. So you're gonna need a PSD file. So we have it right here. I'll have it in the uh, description. So let's go ahead and drag it in. I'm using GIMP. You guys can go ahead and download that. It's pretty similar to Photoshop. So if, if you're on Photoshop and you know all the tools, then uh, if you recognize any of these tools, uh, then it should be pretty easy to follow along. Uh, so anyway, we're just gonna start off with our blend tools. So we want to get rid of this white background. So we're gonna make this why not uh, green and uh, white. So let's drag down. Just do a drag down kind of gesture. And uh, yeah, so everything's all blended up now. So now next we want to add maybe some text. So go ahead and add your text right there. And also you have if you if you have on. Or if you're on GIMP or Photoshop, you have a font thing where you can edit the font. So let's just put matte. And so that's way too small, so we want to increase the size. Uh, we can't barely see that, so let's turn that to black. And so now we're going to use our rotate tool so, uh, so just to rotate it. Make make sure that's lined up, uh, you know, down here. Uh, the rotate tool is right here. Uh, you sh you should just hover over it and it'll tell you what tool it is. Also, the move tool is right here, so we can move it down. Oops, you can move it down a bit. Uh, why do you keep doing that? Okay, so I got it. So yeah, so you want to make sure that's lined up on the edges here. So we want to make another one. Let's put sub. And then we can also change that color down here to black. Move that over a bit. And I know this is a really ugly background, but this is just for uh, just to show you guys. Uh, so if you want fonts, you can go to a website called uh, D A the Font. Uh, yeah, that's that's what it's called. Uh, Google it. It's called the font, and you can go ahead and uh, download different fonts. And all you have to do to install the fonts is uh, right-click, and you should have it installed. That's how it does. That's how it is on Windows 7. Now we want uh, our brushes. So you're gonna go to your paintbrush tool. So you go right here to uh, brush, and we're gonna choose. Uh, you can also download download brushes from. Uh, pretty much all sorts of websites. A lot of them do support Photoshop. So in Photoshop, you're good luck. Uh, but a lot of them also support GIMP too. So we want to change this just to all black. These two over here, you make you can change the color uh, of the font. And you actually want to go to add a new layer when you're making the font. So just hit new layer. Just press OK. So you see, we can also switch up the color if we want make it really cool uh... so yeah so uh, making a youtube background is very easy once you if you know where all the uh... tools are at and it's pretty much it uh, you can go ahead and add anything else you want to it. Uh, you can add like pictures and stuff. You just want to, if you want to add a picture, just take it from the desktop and drag it onto here. And like I said, use your move tool and you can move the pictures around. Uh, so that's pretty much the basics of making YouTube background. I wanted to make this as simple as possible. Uh, so when you're done, you go to save as, and you want to rename this to a .jpg file. You cannot keep it a um just a regular one so you want to save it to desktop a dot jp well, didn't save so save export and here is our youtube background so you can go ahead and uh... apply this to your uh... your um, youtube channel so anyway thanks for watching be sure to uh, click that subscribe button and i'll see you guys later